want to talk a bit more about that quality issue that you talked about. While this one particular case of Ranbaxy obviously was far more uh, higher profile in terms of the value, but there have been similar such instances across many other pharma companies as well. How concerned are you about that? So, as I said, and why why is it happening? So, reason why it's happening is that the prevalence of Indian drugs today in the global markets, particularly in the U.S., is increasing. Uh, drugs made out of by Indian companies. And therefore, there is a pressure to ensure that the quality standards are met. Also, if you look at how the US FDA is operating, they are continuously raising standards year on year because they don't want to take any chances. And because we are exporting out of India, there are many more now inspections done for Indian companies. And I think all this means that uh, they are pointing out even very, very small uh, issues. They are highlight, highlighting them. We have to uh, manage them. We have to in some tackle them and correct whatever the faults are. We are fortunate. We have many plants which are uh, supplying to several global multinationals out of India and outside of India. And we've had repeated inspections done even after this whole episode of Ranbaxy. And uh, we've actually been uh, come out pretty well out of that. Uh, the authorities are happy with what we are giving. But you believe that Indian Pharma could have done without this episode? It, it has given it a bad name. Yes, I mean, it is unfortunate and it ought not to have happened.